Strange how things turn around, Phil, isn't it? Well, again, he's not played a great shot there either, but at 1-0 down, when Mark had a good chance, Stuart Carrington would have hit your arm off for a 2-2 draw. Now, if it ends up in a 2-2 draw, he'll be very disappointed. And so many similarities between this and the first group in which Williams was involved. Well, position all over the place from Mark Williams and the butt of the cue is slammed into the floor in absolute disgust. Yep, we were at... Uh... Our, both our boys were playing in a for Wales on the, on the weekend, and he gave his boy he gave his boy Joel a row for showing emotion. I'll have to show Joel that. If he can have a go at his brother. And then he gets down and serenely just <laughs> floats in the pink <laughs> as though nothing happened. Uh, Yeah, it's been a good uh, a good break this because he's lost the cue ball a few times, but he just carries on potting. 107. As does Jack Jones, making a century. 61. 112. And if he could make a 1-2-5 break, Jones, that would be a really good target if this group or positions came down to high breaks. 62. That red going in has basically sealed this final frame for Mark Williams. Here's one for you, Lee. In the first stage, as I've said before, he drew tall with Conor Benze in his first match. He made a 90 break in the first frame, went 2-1 down, won the fourth. What's he done in this match? Made a 90 break exactly in the first frame, gone 2-1 down and won the fourth. History repeating itself. 78. Yep, Stuart will be kicking himself. 2-1 up, had an excellent chance in the balls. Didn't have to play the shot for the black. Chose to try and get on the black. Didn't get on it. And Mark Williams has produced a good break here. Mourned all the way through, but he still produced a good break. 87, I'm playing Mark Williams. It is 2-1. Need the two reds. The two awkward ones on the bottom cushion. One just needs one good positional shot. And that's it. Played that very nicely. 35 points in front. 16. Should now go on to take this frame. But that's not the best of shots. He's left this a little bit straight. Yep, the look on his face says it all. Had a bit more angle on this black, so he could have played for the loose red. May have to leave this now to the green pocket. Yeah, that's what he's done. 43 in front, 51 on, so it's red to leave. See Joel Weir requiring a snook. A big, big shot for Ben Williston and for the whole group. Because if it goes in, it should mean the first two matches have both been drawn. Twenty-five. 
five. Yeah, played it really well. So, Ben Wollaston, as I say, has done well. He was uh, looking like making it one each, lost his way in that second frame, lost it on the black, but has responded very well since. Made the 73 in the last. So as you actually very nearly got one of these reds, it's uh, as you can see 47 in it, 43 on. So not necessarily done yet. Ben Wollaston, 28. No. Foul. No, it's disastrous. And he's Seven. gonna shake hands. So start. another match ends in a draw then. CJ we made the running by leading 2-0. Ben Wollaston dug in. He won the last two and they take a point apiece. Could well have implanted just a, a seed of doubt in the mind. But boy, has he got away with it. So tough. And the red has stayed in the jaws to such an extent. But even if C can't get through to pot it directly, you can hit one red onto the other. It required such a thin contact. And using the extended rest. Whew. Not the kind of shot you want. No, I mean, he didn't look like he wanted to play it at first, but he saw the chance to potentially win. So, some sort of contact required. But no contact gained. And this could be the end coming up. Williams eight in front. Psychologically, C needed to trick himself there. Just try and pop the, the red he was hitting without thinking about the plant. Ben Wollaston's hopes Eight. slowly evaporating. No. And he'll be thinking back to the first two frames of his match against Mark Williams, where Williams had four flukes. Three in the first frame, then in the 40s 16. in the second frame, another one. And that was the, the frame where he made the 130 break. Not that it looks like mattering now, Dave. 21. Frame I just match. think when it comes to the crunch, Mark Williams is the man and he's done it. He has indeed. The former world champion, the former world seniors champion, 10 years.